Evacuations have been lifted tonight in the Elephant Butte area where dry creek beds turned into rivers and homes miles from the lake were suddenly lakefront property. But the National Guard is still on standby. News 13's Tina Jensen has that story. The rains came in hard and fast in Sierra County. Rainfall started just after midnight. By mid-morning, the banks of this creek overflowed south of TRC, flooding fields and making roads impassable. I love the weather. I love rainy weather. We needed the weather, but it's been it's scary. The whole field was underwater. There was trees going through and old automobiles and stuff. A lot of people used old cars and stuffed them with up against the banks with quit eating it and it dug them all out. The county received more than five inches of rain in just four days. The kind of rainfall longtime residents said they hadn't seen in decades. Not since 1977 has it been this bad. It really got rough. Most of the water came down from up above and uh, the river was already full, backed up and uh, it didn't have a place to go. The Sierra County Sheriff's Office turned into the Incident Command Center. At least one elderly resident had to be rescued, and the National Guard is now in Sierra County on standby. They have vehicles that can get to places that we can't, um, and the, the MPs can basically set up the traffic control points, and that frees up the um, sheriff's deputies and state police to be able to handle the, the calls for service for emergencies. By afternoon, neighbors pitched in to start clearing the muddy roadways. Even though they're bracing for more storms this weekend. Tina Jensen, KRQE News 13.